What's up, YouTube, and welcome back to Let's Play A Hat In Time. In the last episode, we received a mysterious phone call claiming that the Bird Movie Awards were rigged. In this episode, we are going to go to Dead Bird Studio to find out the truth. Dun 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 dun! The truth. The truth is always good. Oh. It appears nobody's around this time around. Let's do this. It's dark. I guess you could say this really is a dead bird studio. <laughs> eh, it kind of worked. I guess just yeah. Oh, okay, yeah, no, okay, okay. I'm done trying to figure out whether or not my joke worked or not. Let's see if we can. Nope, did not make it. I love how dark it is. I like how our um um our uh words our color scheme is margin of the night and it's nighttime here so we're like little ninjas where's the lever oh i see i'm intelligent let's do this uh, i'm smart i'm for the very smartest Oh, oh no, I forgot I wasn't wearing my sprint hat. Hang on. Guys, I think I know how to get that. Haha. -ha. I'm sure you could do this without this doing it on this level, but yeah. Apparently you can jump over that from over yonder. We're ready. Let's head on into the elevator. In time, chapter two, Battle of the Birds, Act Six, Award Ceremony. The real award ceremony. Technically speaking. Whoa. This is a lovely little elevator ride we have here. Very nice, if I do say so myself. Very very deep. How deep does Dead Bird Studio go? Oh, wait, there it is. Found it. Again, not the sprint hat. Let's go up here. Jump on over. Ooh, can we get that right now? No, we can't get it quite yet. Uh, let's see here. What can we... Is there anything in here we can do? What's this? A lot of these look like unpaid bills. Makes sense, you don't really call seeing many cinemas on this planet, and destroying trains probably gets pretty pricey yes, after a few takes. <clears throat> Alrighty then, let's... Let's go ahead and see if there's anything we can get. What's this say? Looks like you're not allowed past this point. Very subtle. N no flying, no eggs, and no humans allowed. Uh... How you gonna stop me? How you gonna stop me, mate? You can't. Um, okay, so how do I get in there? Uh, oh, hi there. What? Um. Um. Okay. I, that, um, um, I found another out of bounds glitch. I'm not even looking for these things, they just kind of, they just kind of show up. And I don't know how I keep it, I keep finding them. It's not even like I'm looking for them. I mean, it's not really much help, can't really do anything in here. Or can you, like, I, I don't, this is so funny. I can't get out this way, so I can't use it to get up into this little tunnel, which is clearly the way to get into that rift token. And I can't get out other, any other way that, other, than, other than... Oh my, am I stuck? I'm not stuck. Okay, so I know how to get in there now, so I'll stop playing around with the 
glitches. Oh, ouch. Oh no. I'm going to die, aren't I? Probably. It's a it's a likelihood that could possibly happen. Oh. Yeah, that's how. I guess if I looked around for more than five seconds, we could figure it out. Rift token. Use it on the arm chain or machine to gain cute rewards. Yeah, I'd say they're pretty cute. I seen a that. Sending me messages, friends. I'm busy at the moment. So you 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 don't get a response. I mean, I guess I could turn off the messages while I'm recording, but I'm lazy. I don't really need to. It doesn't happen often. I don't have a lot of friends on PlayStation that I don't know personally, so. Oh, I don't know about it. No one told her, right? Good. She's got plenty. You don't need this one. Mm. Um, no, I need all of them. I need all of the time pieces to get home. I think. I don't know. I need, I need at least most of them. Mostly, I just need all of them so nobody use, abuses their power. I remember the first time I did this, the way I did it was using the fucking, the freaking wall right here to bounce up and, uh, how did I just do it? Oh, I used the boxes. Yeah, I used the pipes to wall jump back and forth until I got up here. <clears throat> uh, honestly, I think this might be the only episode, only thing we can do this episode. Only thing we have time to do anyway. I don't know, we'll see what happens. Uh, oh, I oh, made it! Go ahead and grab this yarn. Let's see, tin? We need two more before we can craft the dweller hat. Or dweller mask. Same difference. Anyway, let's, let us continue on our search through the world of... Uh, yeah, on the search. Oh, there it is. Okay. I was gonna say, where do we go? How do we get over there? Okay. Uh, what's this say? These shelves are full of movies you've never heard of. The amount of bird puns in the titles is staggering. Um, movie, 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 movies. Ah. I'm drawing a blank on movies that I can make bird puns out of. Uh, high flying, um, Scrambled eggs. I don't. I don't. I'm. I don't know. I'm no good at coming up with puns on the spot. I love making puns, but it's hard. John Bar hinges. You, all you can see through the cracks is a magnet and a pebble, though. I don't get it. What's this one? The label reads MacGuffins. Or is it just MacGuffins? Is that how you spell MacGuffin? That's funny. The label reads Chekhov Guns. Chekhov's Guns. I almost get that one. I recognize the name, but I don't I don't know what it is. Let's go ahead and grab this yarn, and we are now one yarn away from being able to craft a dweller mask. We should be able to get that in this level, I think. Maybe. If we're lucky. Okay, I don't think I could do that. Uh this way. Uh, I think we can make it. Yes, awesome. Okay. Um, oh look, a yarn, and another yarn. There's two yarns. I think we've seen a couple of yarns actually that we can get so far. Yes, I made it. Okay. Um, so far so good. Better be careful saying that though, because usually that can be a jinx. Let's go ahead and. Ooh, a thing. Oh no, I fell off the thing. Yes! You get. Mm, I don't think you get any special rewards for getting all those except for the fancy claps and stuff. Um, can I just. Ow, what? 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 Oh. Oh, what's that rule that. Says you can't fall farther than 
a certain amount before you lose, I guess. I think it's the same for landing on this. Yep. Despite making the landing on the thing, it doesn't count because apparently it's too low. Man. Maybe we should blow it up. I got the bomb from train rat here. Ah, should I use it? Maybe I should save it in case someone shows up. <laughs> um, that's lovely. Oh, that one. Okay, that one I understand because I missed the rope. Okay, I don't, I don't know how we get over there. Okay, so if I can't just jump down onto it. If, so if I can't just jump down onto it, then what do I do? How do I get over there? I don't know. I know not how to play video games anymore because apparently there are rules. Okay, why? Why do with I why do with I miss? It's because I can't aim. I don't know. At this rate, I'm not going to finish this level at all. So I don't know. If I could figure it out in like 10 minutes, then I'll figure it out in like 10 minutes. But I don't foresee me figuring it out in 10 minutes. Anyway, let's go ahead and grab this yarn. We have more than enough now to craft the Dweller Mask, but to be fair, as of right now, we don't need it, so I'll craft it whenever we need it. Just head on. Head on this direction. Go ahead and get another one of these little switch puzzle thingies. Ah, camera angles! Camera angles! Um, let's just do some wall jumps and stuff. I don't think there's anything this way we can do. So let's go ahead and hit this switch. That's two of four. Halfway there. There's one over there and one up there. Let's go for the one up there first. Let's go ahead and get past this little penguin. Uh, how do we... Okay, I see it. I couldn't see the... Or I didn't notice the tightrope. Let's go ahead and get up here and hit this switch. I uh, don't think I could time that jump quite perfectly, so I'll just time that jump, and that jump. I'm going to go ahead and get our way up here, and boom, we got them all. Let's go ahead and, well actually let's make sure there's nothing up there. It's a little late now, but I don't see anything else up there that we could use. Go ahead and just do our little double jump. Let's head on this way. Hey, this place looks familiar. Dun, 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 dun. I got a theory. Perhaps it was the conductor that made that purple time rift. I don't know. It's just it's just a fun little thought to think about, though, when you think about it. Like each player or each person is causing time rift. Oi! I think it explains why certain things like that happened in Mafia Town. So I guess it would make sense. But that'll, that'll be explained whenever I actually go do the time rips in Mafia Town. Uh, ooh, sweet, I actually made it. Let's see what's in here. Oh, my. There's uh, a lot of trophies. Hey, look, a key. Oh, this must be the right way. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> Go ahead and get, grab the key. It strikes you that this might be the gaudiest, most ex most excessive thing you've ever seen. It doesn't look like there's an easy way to take it with you either. Shame. <laughs> That's funny. A gilded hair dryer. Or hand dryer. Sorry, I don't know where ha hair dryer came from. I guess you could use it to dry your hair. It would just be very, very monotonous. What's this one? Hey, hey I'm hiding. I'm hiding in the letters. Picture perfect. I, li I like the little posters for all of the movies that are scattered out through this area. The big parade. This must be Groove's room. Or at least one of them, anyway. Uh, what is over this way? Oh, oh, don't jump into the camera. Okay. 
go over the camera. Okay, let's see if we can... Okay, uh, that's... I just don't even know where this key is used for anymore. Hook shot over the camera stuff. Uh, did I see anything? Uh, no. Oh, I fell. Murder on the Aliexpress. These posters came out pretty great. Though, it occurs to you, you never gave them permission to use your image in marketing. Actually, you don't recall signing a contract for anything here, or even giving them any of your details. It's possible that you aren't getting paid for these movies. And that's when you get suing. It's amazing that they went through all that trouble without actually doing anything to protect themselves from the legal legalese. Is that what is that the word that fancy people use to describe that stuff? Legalese. I don't know. I'm not. I'm not a fancy person. I, I don't know my. Oh, that's. Oh, it's a timing jump. Okay, that confused me. Um, where, oh, where does this key go to? Because I swear I don't remember needing a key. Or do it. Oh, <laughs> I did need the key. You know, how would I have gotten back had I not used the key? Oh, the elevator. Restricted access, no kids, only birds allowed, no humans allowed. No cats allowed. How rude. I say as my kitty gets on me and lays down. No humans allowed. Well, too bad, I got the key. That immediately makes me allowed. Relic. This unknown relic might match with others. Just maybe. Just maybe. Is that all that was for? Really? That's all that was for? I forgot about that. Oh well. Let's go ahead and take the elevator. Actually, I think the elevator is exactly where we're supposed to go in the first place. I'm glad I didn't go in it. That would have ended badly. Chapter 2, Battle of the Birds, Act 6, Award Ceremony. You know what? Let's do it. Guess you found my little basement, eh? This last timepiece is all mine. If you want it, you're gonna have to take it from me cold, dead hands. And here we have the boss battle with the conductor. It this does indeed change, apparently, but not by much, apparently. So basically, all that changes if you were to have DJ Grooves winning is basically the props and apparently everything else. Oh, I missed. Yeah. Basically, whenever he lands down here, you wanna you can hit him. You can hit him. I'm sure you can hit him there too. But yes, if DJ Grooves wins, you will be fighting DJ Grooves here instead, just in case you didn't follow the way I did it exactly, which I don't know why you would honestly. But either way, you just dodge the attacks and hit him whenever he's laying on the ground. And occasionally the audience will apparently throw heart pawns towards you, which would have been great information to have the first time I did this boss battle. Because the first time I did this boss battle, it took me forever. It was also against grooves, and that's why I did the conductor this time. I might just show grooves this battle. A little bit, like little screenshots and stuff of it. Just, just so you guys can see the differences on the stage and whatnot. Nice. That's the knife from Murder on the Owl Express. Oh, you feeling a little stabby? Well, I'm feeling a little homing attacky. I guess. I don't know. What? Oh, oh no! Oh, shockwave! Hey, that's the first time I got hit. At least I don't have the one-hit wonder badge. <laughs> that, that's funny. 
Honestly, I like this battle a lot better than DJ Groove's battle. Maybe it's because I like the conductor as a better, better. I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. I haven't decided it, honestly. I kind of like them both. They both have their own unique aspects and annoyances. <laughs> Basically, what you want to do in this situation is don't get in the red line. Basically, you want to stay off the red carpet. I like how pictures work as the same thing. Too bad real life doesn't work that way. Wasn't there a game about that? Haha. <laughs> Ha. It'll be the last one usually, I think, I don't know. Usually you'll see a silhouette by the time. Just stay out of the red, and you should be good. Sprint hat is helpful because it allows you to avoid... Ow. Slice of life. Slice of life. I don't think this is a slice of life episode, though. I don't think I'd consider it a slice of life episode. Oh my god. Oh my lord. Yes, you can hit him after, right off the... Just go ball. Yeah, well. Too bad. You did. Um, what's going on here? Ooh. Let's have a little heart to heart. Have a seat, lassie. Um. Okay. Ever since you arrived on this planet, these time pieces have been falling from the sky. Now, I can understand if you feel they belong to you. I get it, but did you know I can rewind time? Yeah, that's why I need them back, so people like you don't use them to screw with time. With one timepiece, I could reclaim the trophy that belongs to me. That's right, the loss of award 42. The meaning of life award? Oh wait, wrong, wrong thing. I got second place at the 42nd annual Beard Awards. Me? Can you imagine? DJ... Groves managed to get the first place trophy. I need just one timepiece to fix this mistake. Can't you spare just one timepiece? Nope. Oh, you're a greedy young lass, aren't you? I just need a single one, and you're one sheer. Well, if you want this timepiece back so bad, come and get it! <laughs> Oh my, what is, what is going on here? What do I have attached to my body? What do I have attached to my body? Remember this little bomb? This time, it's attached to you instead of me lovely chain. <laughs> um, I am not okay with this. This is not an okay situation. Away, no, you are not. I don't think I hit him. I should have hit him. Hit oh, hi! I I saw what you did there. Ha! I gotcha. Nope. Can't touch you. You cannot touch me, even though you just did twice. You got 45 seconds. Oh my! This is. Oh, this is. Oh no. 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 I will not die. I haven't died on this battle yet. I will not die on this battle. I will survive. I will not lose. I will not. I refuse. I refuse death. Then again, the last time I. Yeah. That's. That's how that goes. I hope I don't have to restart the whole battle. Do I have to restart the whole battle? Or is it just part of it? I think it's just part of it. We're, we're gonna find out here in a second. So far, I'm thinking it's the whole thing, and then that's concerning to me. Um, I think whenever you die in these boss battles, they kind of... They kind of make you redo a little bit of it, but at the same time, I think they shrink it around a little bit. I don't know, I can't ever tell. Mostly because I don't pay attention to how many times I've hit them. Anyway. Die. Uh, 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 I think it's the whole battle. I'll see you guys when we get back to where we were.
Darn it. Have a little heart to heart. Have a seat, lassie. <sighs> Ever since you arrived on this planet, these times wait, 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 I think, I think I'm going to show you what happens if you do the now, maybe. I can understand if you feel they belong to ye. I get it. But did you know I can rewind time with one time piece? I can reclaim the trophy that belongs to me. That's right, the loss of award 42. I got second place at the 42nd. I need just one timepiece to fix this mistake. Can't you spare just one timepiece? Maybe. Thank you, lassie. Oh, you won't regret it. We'll fix this little mistake in history and go back to having a flawless record. Unfortunately, I cannot let you leave this room. I can't waste words getting out. DJ Picnic will mock me for cheating. Nah, this is this is why you that don't trust nice birds without eyes. Goodbye. Now that was just rude. You don't repay generosity by stabbing someone on the back. A lot of people have learned that lesson, but you are about to learn that lesson. This time, it's attached to you. Okay, I think we'll, con we'll continue off from here, because I think this is when he starts throwing his saw blades at you. Can I even hit him? You can't hit him. Homing attacks. Homing attacks are for life. For life. Okay, yeah, so this is where we'll will. So it doesn't really matter what you choose in that, in that dialogue. It just changes the dialogue a little bit. So let's go ahead and avoid getting hit a couple times. Hopefully without death. Hopefully we can kill him this time without dying again for the third time. Third time's the charm, right? That's how, that's the way it works. Is that the way the world works? Hey, it's DJ Grooves. I will find a way to defuse the bomb. That's not his accent. But I don't know why I went that way. But it, but it kind of just what happened. Yeah, got him. You got 30 seconds. Come on, Pecknick. Oh wait. Ugh. Got him. Ha! Got him. Nope, you can't touch me, Danny. Ow. You touched me. Stop touching me. You're getting really cocky, group conductor. My, my diffuser is ready. Come here. Uh, yep. You get the bomb diffused. Sweet. End of full life. Let's finish this up. Oh, oh no, I already hate you. I don't remember this in the last battle, but I don't care. It, it might have been. I don't I don't remember. Anyway, let's finish this. Hopefully quickly so we don't have to deal with the band anymore. Oh, what? 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 I'm, oh, okay. I found, I'm found again. Oh, that was... That was unnerving. Got him. He's not dead yet. Somehow. Ow. Oh, no. Uh, grab the life. Grab the life. Grab the life. Where do you, where do you go? There he is. And we did it. We got it. We finally beat him. Yay. Oh, my. That could have... Oi. That took a lot longer than I expected it to, honestly. That's... Go ahead and grab this. Grab our final timepiece from chapter two, I think. I believe it's the final timepiece anyway. Yes. We unlocked that room, but that's chapter four. We have we still have to do chapter three. And with that, we have officially completed chapter two. I think there's still collectibles in a few of these that we need to get but for the most part I believe we finished all of it we will come back for the collectibles at the end of the game honestly but for now in the next episode we will head off to subcon forest where we will probably not finish it but we will definitely 
definitely continue. Oh, time rift detected, apparently. I don't think we'll be doing a time rift, but we will definitely be... We will definitely be doing it. Let's... Real fast. Before we end the diary things off, let's go ahead and check this, because this does change based on... Who is with people on this planet double-crossing me? I'm not dumb. That's the last time I get involved in show business for a long time. I missed the thing. Okay, anyway. With, with that done, see you guys in the next episode.